Hello, beautiful people, and welcome to your reading. I'm Clarity Bay. I'm a psychic tarot intuitive, and I'm dedicated to answering the questions that are most important to you. And in your reading, I'm going to give you clear insight on whether or not he regrets losing you, his true breakup feelings. I will share with you everything that spirit gives to me and not leave anything out. Please take one moment to click that like and subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so that you do not miss an important video message. Let's get into your reading. Meditate here on the three piles and pick the one that calmly draws you the most. This would be one, two, and three. Let's get straight into your reading. Hello, beautiful pile one. Welcome to your reading. I'm Clarity Bay. I'm a psychic tarot intuitive, and I'm dedicated to answering the questions that are most important to you. And in your reading, I'm going to give you clear insight on whether or not he regrets losing you. His true breakup feelings. I will give to you everything that spirit gives to me and not leave anything out. Please take one moment to click that like and subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so that you do not miss an important video message. Let's get straight into your reading. I can see here that your energy, it naturally attracts you here to the card representing the Father of Cups. And with the Father of Cups being your point of attraction, let me just say that the Cups energy is Strong emotional energy, water energy, representing those water zodiac signs. You're seeing Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio, and the sun, moon, or rising, seventh house of relationships, or the planet Venus, and his birth chart, or your birth chart, as a confirmation here in this reading. And... This Father of Cups energy is, I'm feeling that he's definitely in a very emotionally connective state of mind right now. And he does regret um, specific aspects of the relationship of losing you. And let's get more details on this. Thank you, Spirit. Does he regret losing you, his true breakup feelings. I know I was a distraction from your pain. So this is telling me that there was a connection between you two where you shared pain that you had experienced um, prior to meeting him. And he was a little different. He kept a lot of his challenges that he had, you know, in his childhood with his parents or even past relationships. He kept them a bit quiet. He did express some things to you, but he does um, know that because he connected with you, he that did allow you to heal some of your past childhood wounds. So he is fully aware of that. Let's get more insight. Thank you, Spirit. Does he regret losing you? What are his true breakup feelings? The Galactic Federation, collaborations, meetings, and community here. So yes, the communion that he shared with you, being with you, felt really like he had you in his corner. You were the one that was there for him to listen to, you know, his goals, his aspirations, things he wanted to do with his career. I feel like you did collaborate with him and you were just always there. Your ear, giving him the ear, you know, the opportunity to hear him out, for him to vent, you know, on certain things that were going on in his life. And he misses that. He regrets that breakup connection, that disconnection, the communication that he was able to have with you. He truly regrets that. Let's get more insight. Thank you, Spirit. 
Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. You have here the nine of wands. So this is clearly a passionate connection that he really wishes he had again with you. Fire energy representing those fire zodiac signs. Sagittarius, Leo, and Aries in the top placements of the birth chart that I did mention moments earlier. But with the nine of wands energy, this is definitely about how... You know, he regrets that he pushed you to the point of, you know, making you, you know, put up your defenses and causing you to create, you know, persistent boundaries, you know, associated with him. So the nine of wands is about you keeping and maintaining these persistent boundaries where you're not allowing him to get too close to you, to drain you, to text you, to call you, you know, as often as he could before. You're blocking his calls and his numbers, blocking him on social media, but he is still on your social media pages. You just don't see him. He's there under a new account. And even if you've blocked him with that feature, you know, on your social media where it's says block this account and block any other accounts that he may have. He has another phone where he is prying on you, searching your pages to see if you are communicating with other people. Also worry about you being in meetings with other people and working with other people when it comes to your creative goals as well. So let's get more insight. You gave this guy lots of support, lots of emotional support, mental support. And I do believe physical and some sort of financial support as well. And so he definitely is regretting that and missing that connection. Let's get more insight. Thank you, Spirit. Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. Look at this, the Grim Reaper. The relationship is over. You cannot make up this energy. No second chances in this relationship connection. He's wanting these second chances, but he knows there are no second chances. Because you expected him to grow and transform his life like you're doing right now. And he just stayed in the same place all the time not wanting to evolve, not wanting to recognize where he could grow and not wanting to, you know, um, really reflect on his flaws and the things that he was doing wrong. So yes, he was a distraction from your pain in the beginning, but he also was the cause of some of your confusion, you know, which in turn did cause you a lot of emotional pain. Thank you, Spirit, for that wonderful confirmation. Let's get more insight. Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. And this card was just boom, trying to pop out. The King of Cups. Yes, he does. But he's very worried. Look out. Let me just point out the energy here, how it's lining up with the Father of Cups here. And then you have the King of Cups laying naturally under the Father of Cups. That's a very strong correlation. Thank you, Spirit. The not the king of cups. This is the king of coins. So this is physical energy. Physical. He's regretting the physical presence of you. Looking at you. Touching you. Being together with you. And this is a wonderful co uh, correlation with the Galactic Federation. Collaborating with you. Meeting up with you. Going out on excursions. Thank you, Spirit. The king of coins energy. Let me point out, though, that he is... Um, regretting how solid you are, how practical you were with the relationship. You actually led the relationship because of your wisdom here. And you invested a lot of time in this guy, a lot of time and energy, emotional energy, as mentioned earlier, as well as some financial investments in him. And he understands that there, there was a lot of value in your relationship. And he misses that value. He knows that he'll never find this type of connection again. Let's get more insight. Thank you, Spirit. Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. 
Knight of Pentacles. Look at that. Two pentacle cards coming out back to back. So you have here the king of coins. That's also known as a pentacle. And you have here the knight of pentacles. So it could be known as the coins or the pentacles or the disc. They're all earth, physical energy, representing those earth signs. Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. In the top placements of the birth chart, sun, moon, or rising, seventh house of relationships, or the planet Venus, seen in his birth chart or your birth chart as a confirmation here in this reading. But let me do point out that with this Knight of Pentacles energy, this is a definitely, definitely a strong confirmation here that he is very worried about you connecting with, you know, someone that you resonate with on a romantic level. Someone that is going to propose to you, someone that you find quite charming because he lacked this sociability skills. He lacked the ability to be intimate and truthful with you because he was really fear of being vulnerable. And that was just really a reflection of an insecurity that he has. And he knows about this insecurity, but he is just really not in a place now to move forward on, you know, um, self-growth and self-awareness. So you're encouraged here. You know exactly who this guy is. You know how you felt with him emotionally. You know that just because, yes, he does regret the relationship, this relationship is not right for you because of how you felt while you were in it. While, while you were in it. So you're encouraged to trust your intuition to move forward because there is someone for you. You're resonating here highly with the Knight of Pentacles and wanting to connect here with this lover energy. This person that will give you his time, devotion, and loyalty. This person that will express himself fully and this person that will take care of you. Yes, you have the ability to take care of yourself, to raise your own money, but this Knight of Pentacles is really resonating in your vibrational frequency. This is a true alpha male that wants to take care of you. He knows that you're able to take care of yourself, but he is willing to do it for you. So keep your focus on your self-worth and your value. And I can see that this is where you are in this reading, the vibe of your energy coming through here. This guy did not understand what he had in the relationship with you. So these are the aspects that he is truly regretting losing about you. So group one, this does conclude your reading. I hope this reading does resonate with you and inspire you. If it does, please leave a comment below because I do love reading your comments. They definitely warm my heart and they make my day. I am sending you lots of love and good energy. Hello, beautiful pile two, and welcome to your reading. I'm Clarity Bay. I'm a psychic tarot intuitive, and I'm dedicated to answering the questions that are most important to you. And in your reading, I'm going to give you clear insight on whether or not he regrets losing you, his true breakup feelings. I will share with you everything that spirit gives to me and not leave anything out. Please take one moment to click that like and subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so that you do not miss an important video message. Let's get straight into your reading. So I can clearly see here that your energy resonates here with the card that you naturally are drawn to, strength. And with the strength card showing up, this is a clear indication that this guy is missing your self-confidence, self-assurance, um, uh, the unconditional love that you showed him. You were there for him in every way. And he is missing that a lot. Let's get more details. More details here, spirit. Thank you. Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. Thank you, spirit. The queen of swords. So with the Queen of Swords energy, this is air sign energy. This is about what's on his mind, his intellect. And with the Swords energy, air signs representing Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, 
in the top placements of the birth chart, sun, moon, or rising, seventh house of, of relationship, or the planet Venus in his birth chart or your birth chart as a confirmation here in this reading. But let me just point out what I'm picking up here with the Queen of Swords energy is um, he is a definitely missing your honesty. You are very honest and you speak what is on your mind and see you are real with it. Okay. And you are very self-sufficient where you can take care of yourself. And he recognizes that now that, um, he's not in a relationship with you. He recognized your value and your self-worth as this queen of swords. Let's get more insight. Thank you, spirit. Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. Does he regret losing you? Thank you, spirit. I hid who I really am from you. There you go. This guy was definitely wearing a mask in the relationship. He was not being himself which I feel like is what aggravated the relationship and where a lot of the frustrations came from because his actions did not match his um, words. So whatever he was telling you, it could never match up. And he was hiding who he really um, was with you. And so you never really felt this intimate connection with him. You And I feel like it was due to you know, him just really being afraid to be vulnerable. He feels like being vulnerable is weak and feminine, and which is he, he's definitely sadly mistaken. And I feel like he's carrying this same energy into other relationships, whether they're platonic or romantic. He's just really in a space of not being his true self. Let's get more insight. Thank you, Spirit. Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. Blue Avions, philosophy, reasoning, karma, and mysticism. So yeah, I feel like he's definitely receiving um, karma regarding his actions in this relationship. He's dealing with the karma he's having to face. He thinks about certain things that you shared with him. You are very um, interested in uh, philosophical knowledge, philosophy, and quotes and things like that. And he thinks about that a lot, how intelligent you are. And it's just a, a mystery surrounding the blue avions energy and i love the correlation of the blue avions showing up with the message i hid who i really am from you blue avions laying naturally under this message because it's about mysticism this guy had um secrets that he did not want you to know but i feel like you did eventually uh, come to terms with what he was hiding and your intuition is definitely correct Trust your intuition on this one because spirit did download the truth um, into your consciousness regarding him. Let's get more insight. Thank you, spirit. Does he regret losing you? His true feelings about the breakup. Ten of Wands. So with the Ten of Wands energy, this is a fiery, passionate energy representing those fire signs, Sagittarius, Leo, and Aries in the top placements of the birth chart that I did mention earlier in his birth chart or your birth chart as a confirmation here in this reading. I do find it quite intriguing that the Ten of Wands laid naturally under the Strength card, which the Strength card does represent the sign of Leo, and Leo is a fire sign, and the Ten of Wands energy is definitely about, he's definitely stressed out about the relationship, feeling very exhausted, so this is definitely an opposite of strength here. Ten of Wands, strength. 
exhaustion here in the Ten of Wands, whereas you are very strong after moving on from this relationship and he is exhausted. Well, because when he was with you, you felt like he was draining you of your energy, which he was. He was using your energy supply as his. So now um, the Ten of Wands reflecting back here in this reading is saying that he's feeling like um, a lot is on his plate now because he's not in a relationship with you. There's so many things now that he has to do for himself. He has to think for himself. He has to come up with his own energy supply and come up with his own um, inspiration and f philosophical you know, awareness that will help him thrive in life because whereas you were giving him that in the relationship, he has to seek it on his own. And so therefore he's definitely regretting those aspects of the relationship with you. Let's get more insight. Does he regret losing you? His true feelings about the breakup. The runner runner in a codependent relationship. That's what this relationship was. The spirit just not give us that insight seconds earlier about how he did depend on you. So this was definitely codependent, but he was codependent because he had a fear of intimacy and he was really just listening to his ego the whole time in the relationship and not listening to his heart. Thank you, Spirit. Let's get more insight. Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. And you have here the Eight of Coins. Physical. Missing your physical presence. Physical energy. Representing those earth zodiac signs, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo mentioned in the top placements of the birth chart, his birth chart, or your birth chart as a confirmation here in this reading. Let me just point out, he does miss the fact represented here with this age of pentacles energy that um, he really enjoyed being with you. He enjoyed watching you work. You know, he know that you enjoyed your, like your crafts, your gifts, things that you would work on. Um, he misses, you know, that connection with you of how you talked about your creative goals and things that you worked on because that's high vibrational energy, you know, being appreciative of your gifts and talents, um, which you express to him all the time by way of working on these things. So you had a, uh, a high essence of vibrational energy about you that he is not connected to anymore. And he must source his own supply of this energy frequency. And so this is what he does regret here. Thank you, Spirit. So, uh, Pile 2, this does complete your reading, concludes this energy of this guy's regretfulness of this relationship. I hope this reading does resonate with you and inspire you. If it does, please leave a comment below because I do love reading your comments. They definitely warm my heart and they make my day. I am sending you lots of love and good energy. Hello, beautiful Pio 2, and welcome to your reading. I'm Clarity Bay. I'm a psychic tarot intuitive, and I'm dedicated to answering the questions that are most important to you. And in your reading, I'm going to give you clear insight on whether or not he regrets losing you, his true breakup feelings. I will give to you everything that spirit gives to me and not leave anything out. Please take one moment to click that like and subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so that you do not miss an important video message. Let's get straight into your reading. So I can clearly see here that your energy, it naturally attracts you to the car representing the father of swords. And with this being your first point of attraction, let me just point out that this sword's energy represents those 
air zodiac signs, Gemini, Aquarius, and Libra in the sun, moon, or rising, the seventh house of relationships, or the planet Venus in his birth chart or your birth chart as a confirmation here in this reading. Okay, so what I'm picking up with this Father of Swords energy is that this guy really had some communication flaws or challenges when it came to the relationship. He was very authoritative. He wanted to control the dynamics of the relationship as well as you, where you went, who you spoke to, um, the type of people that you interacted with, as well as the way that you did dress. And so he is aware of his controlling energies here and how he did communicate um, these things to you. Let's get more details to see if he does regret losing you. Thank you, Spirit. Does he regret losing you? His true feelings about the breakup. I don't react when people mention you. So this is a clear indication that because this guy does not respond or react when other people mention you, his friends, his families, his colleagues, he tries to stay kind of like, you know, nonchalant and feels like, you know, to look like he's unbothered. This is a clear indication that he is truly in his feelings over this breakup and it bothers him quite a bit just because for the simple fact that he doesn't react means that he doesn't want people to know how he really feels let's get more insight thank you spirit does he regret losing you his true breakup feelings you have here the syrians responsibilities, lessons, and growing up. So he's definitely dealing with a lot on his plate right now as far as karmic lessons here. Knowing that um, he was very childish in the relationship and he's dealing with the challenges of really growing up as an adult. And he realizes that... <sighs> He missed the ball when it came to dealing with his responsibilities in a relationship. Being a provider and a protector is something that he was not. And he really regrets that he did not show you uh, this side of himself. I do love the correlation between the Father of Swords and the Syrian showing up, representing responsibilities. Yes, he dropped the ball a big time when it came to his responsibilities. Now, you could have children by this um, person as well because of the Father of Swords showing up, or he did want you to have a child with him. And so something about his responsibilities and his children that um, he was not capable of fulfilling to the best of his abilities and he now knows this. Let's get more insight. Thank you, spirit. Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. The will of fortune. Yes, he does regret losing you. He feels like you are the winning lottery ticket that he did throw away. With the will of fortune, he had everything that he ever wanted in the relationship with you. As far as a loyal, trusting partner, someone that supported him, someone that put up with his BS far beyond the time limit. You know, you just put up with um, certain things that you knew better. And with the will of fortune energy showing up, let me just point out that you were good fortune to him. The time that he was with you, lots of great things did take place in his life. But he gambled with the relationship, with being, you know, dishonest and disloyal, playing games, playing mind games. He gambled with the relationship. And he, he regrets that a lot. Let's get more insight. Thank you, Spirit. 
Does he regret losing you? His true breakup feelings. Let me just get this card deck together. Paradise. You see that? Yes. Spirit just gave us the insight that there was happiness with you. Um, lots of expansion and joy while he was in the relationship. Because of your playfulness, your personality, very playful, there was oneness that you wanted while being with him. And you really enjoyed each other at the beginning of the relationship. And he threw it all away, you know, by being mischievous and playing mind games. It was paradise for him to be in the relationship with you. And he thought the grass was greener on the other side, but the grass is green where you water it. And he did not take the time out to water the grass that was growing right in front of his eyes, such lush, green, prosperous grass. He did not water that grass. So he's dealing with deep regret right now. Let's get more insight. Thank you, Spirit. Does he regret losing you? His a true relationship breakup feelings. Queen of Cups. Yes, indeed. This is you, the Queen of Cups. Let me point out that that cup energy is the uh, zodiac water signs. Representing those zodiac water signs, Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces in the sun, moon, or rising, seventh house of relationships, and the planet Venus in his birth chart or your birth chart as a confirmation here in this reading. Queen of Cups energy. You know what he really misses about you? How you are this beautiful, nurturing person, very healing, and you were very supportive to this guy in this relationship. And not only in a relationship with him, but this is your character, your personality. You're very healing in general. And you probably are in the healing arts of writing, meditation, massage, something to do with evoking inspiration in others, liberating others. It's where your heart is, wanting to see others win and grow. Happiness surrounds you. Paradise. Look at these three cards, the Wheel of Fortune, Paradise, and the Queen of Cups. Three of all the same high, vib high vibrational frequency is what he misses about you. He threw away the winning lottery ticket of relationships and he regrets it. This is why he, can't, he doesn't react when people mention you. When people say, hey, how is she doing? He's like, oh, I haven't talked to her. Oh, I think she's okay. And, and he changes the subject because he can't stand the fact that he didn't take care of his responsibilities as a mature male in the relationship. And he's having to deal with these lessons that he must karmically learn. Let's get more insight. Thank you, Spirit. Does he regret losing you? His true Feelings about the breakup. Nine of Wands. Nine of Wands. He regrets how he treated you emotionally, physically, verbally, the communication. He regrets it. And with the Nine of Wands energy, this is about you keeping and maintaining persistent boundaries around this guy. You are not allowing him to infiltrate your spirit. So you are not taking text, phone calls, answering emails, not going to his social media pages. And because he cannot contact you and be in your world to get this beautiful energy that you do have, 
he is re very regretful now. You blocked him. You cut him off completely. And you're encouraged to understand that because he does regret losing you, that this was part of your life's purpose to interact with him, to be in a relationship with him, because this is, this is what allowed you to grow and evolve and to become even a higher and greater version of yourself. Trust your intuitions. This does not mean because he regrets losing you that you are meant to go back to him. And I already know that you know that. But just to make a point that you are worthy and you know you're worthy. You know your value. You know that you're this queen of cups. You know that you deserve happiness, expansion, and joy, playfulness, oneness, and a relationship where there is enjoyment of each other. This is what you deserve and this is what's coming to you because you were strong enough to let this energy go and to recognize your true worth. So, pile three, this does conclude your reading. I hope this reading does resonate with you and inspire you. If it does, please leave a comment below because I do love reading your comments. They definitely warm my heart and they make my day. I am sending you lots of love and good energy. Mm -hmm.